back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Sonofka 19. Yeah, I kind of lightened up on the Sonofka part, didn't I? Well, how y'all doing, folks? It's your host with not the most Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, today, um, I feel stupid. I feel stupid. Let me get to the, oh, we'll finish on Phil. 13, I won't miss the thing up there. I know we got a little bit to go there, but it said we was done, so we are done. Now, we're going to go in here real quick while it's folding up. We got field 17. We are in field uh, 13. 17, I couldn't get done. It stopped right there, 14%, and it won't go no further. Well, Mr. Blue, what's, what's the problem, you might ask? Well, Here's 13. We are done with it. The problem is, <laughs> the problem is, is because I'm stupid. Well, actually, I'm not stupid. I just didn't know. Let's see. I'm going to set the contract on that and fill eight. There ain't more fertilizing. Oh, fill 36. Okay, fill 36 fertilizing. Uh, don't worry. I'm not going to do all these on screen. Uh, our main thing today is doing some uh, R fields, but I'm going to try to get where y'all can see this pretty good. I probably went moving the wrong way. Scroll on back to the grass here. All right, folks, y'all see that red, yellow, green line at the top left corner at the bottom of that little square there? It says nitrogen liquid fertilizer application. It says application rate. 90 liters and hectare, which is 39 percent. Okay. Uh, if I hold my left bumper, uh, middle ways up box there, it says activate automatic application rate. Okay. That is activated. Now you go down there and it says application rate zero uh, H. Zero liters, hectares, 39% in, or nitrogen, I guess, and it says auto. You want that to not say auto. So, yeah, back up to the middle of the box, activating automatic application rate. You want that where it says activate. That means it's disabled, and you're going to activate it. You do not want it activated. That's why the missions was not working with me. I'd go in here, I'd get like a, you know, we'll get field 17 here. I've already sprayed it across the whole thing, so it's useless now because I had it on automatic. You want the automatic off. That's where we was messing up. So we're going to cancel that and collect zero dollars from that. So we got fertilizing, fertilizing, and harvesting. Let's jump on over to our harvesting. I'm going to shut this tractor off. And let's jump over, okay? All right, here we are. And we're laying down the straw. And this is soybeans, folks. That's right. Soybean straw. Uh, now, we got John in the tractor now. I mean, in the combine. That field right across from us, it's also a contract. So we're going to try to get it to and use the same combine, hopefully. If not, but anyway, check out our new toy. And I think it's a screenshot. But, there's a big butt, folks. I, this is a sullage. Uh, well, let me just go in here and show y'all. Wrong one. Go in here and show y'all. It's under wheel loaders. Now we'll go all the way over to the end almost. And this is the things that you get for this uh, vehicle. The shovel. And it does all of that. I mean all of it. And this here does like straw, sullage, hay, grass. But right there is our sullage pit. This is what I got. And you see here, zero, zero, here, here, you know. And here it shows I got one, 
I haven't got that. It shows zero. Just to show y'all. This is why I'm broke, by the way, besides, you know, doing those contracts. Uh, it, it does silage, too. The brush and log port, it does this. But, but, I cannot get that diggum pit to open. Let's go on over to our wheel loaders real quick so y'all can see this. So you know how much I paid for it. It's this right here. 58,000, but no. Factory new, forestry, yes. One in triangle. Brought it to 59,200, and that's what it looks like in the store. So, yeah. Why did you get that, Mr. Blue, when you know you broke? Folks, I got that because of this. My back was giving out living this stuff. I sent most of it off. Um. The, uh, oh, I can't even think what to call it, limbs. The smaller limbs I cut off, and I took quite a few of them to uh, the lumberyard and also went over here. Run for the shrine. I tried to level out this. I took all the trees down, and all these trees went to the lumberyard, lumber yard, and that's why I, I ended up with the loader but this here would not let me flatten it out no more it says the trains unable to to modify or whatever it's two or three spots so I don't know if I'll be able to make that a uh, as you can see I cut the road out right here uh, the road was even here it went across I cut it out and uh, I just can't do nothing to it so I figured it'd just be a turnaround area. So I don't know how full he is, but uh, let's see here. F1 does it tell me? 54%. Uh, and I'll show y'all where this is going as soon as I get down here out of his way. And hopefully I have a course play route. I don't think it's going to bakery. I might be wrong though. Anyway, let's go in here. Um, it is soybeans, field 20, and village grain elevator. Yay, just lovely. Just lovely. I'm going to have to make another uh, road. But village grain elevator is straight off across that way. Go in here. Go to here. Uh, what is that? Village Green Elevator right here. We'll mark it. Yep. See, it's right straight across there. That's where we've been taking our stuff to. Ah, he's got a fast takeoff. Sync speed with him, and yeah, we're, he's 42% and going down. We're gonna get him unloaded. And we're gonna start our guys on uh, working our fields too. I already got one field plowed up. You know, it it needed it, but it was already cultivated. I'm like, I'm gonna go ahead and and. Uh, Get it plowed so uh, everything we need. Alright, he is empty. Go over here, that give us a few minutes. Shut this motor off. Well, folks, I hope y'all are doing okay. Uh, yeah, let's go in this thing here and look at it since it's our toy for the day. We got a couple levers there, and a joystick. No joystick and a bunch of buttons over here. Oh wow. Kinda of hard to see with that screen out there, but this thing gets up speed too. So our next thing is I want to buy a dolly and a trailer. And I'm hoping since I got these contracts figured out 
we uh, can get them in this episode, hopefully. But anyway, uh, let's see. Let's go back there. Here's our guy. Uh, we want to put Mr. Yankee here. Cultivating. Um, I already got this little section here sprayed, so. Oop, no, back this way. Now we got to get this uh, here. It needs to go to... I don't know if I got um, 8 and 36. Okay, 8 and 36. Where's our 8? Field 8, field 8. Okay, it's right over there. And 36 is all the way down the bottom. All right, we're going to go do field 8. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold back up. Let's see here. I'm... Yeah, I need to go back that way. All right, I'll meet y'all over field eight. All right, this is field eight. That's uh, behind Sunoco Village there, or whatever it's called. And uh, market shops like right over there. Um, I doubt if we have enough to finish this field. So that's kind of why I'm doing it. So it'll go a little bit faster. So yeah. Wow. I just had enough to get it done, folks. All right, field eight's complete. Let's see, Petro's good. Let's go get some more fertilizer and take care of our field before Mr. Yankee gets over in our spot. All right, I just told the store that I wanted some fertilizer and they said they would have it out for me. I probably get on to me for cutting across the grass, but why go all the way down and cut through? I gotta check on Mr. Yankee too. He should be getting pretty close. Yeah, gonna have to hurry up. Oh, what a bump. Whoa, that's a big bump. And there's a header trailer that we didn't use. We cut across the field. <laughs> Alright, we got that filled up. See y'all at the, our field that won't get over. Alright, we made it back. I just hope he, uh, Hasn't crossed over the fertilized part yet. There's a tractor with the plow. We made that feel bigger too. Like I said, that's the one that needed. Uh, it was already cultivated, but it needed plowing, and I didn't want to do that. So, oh, he got pretty close. He, he's got pretty close. Oh, I right, back up some. Forgot this thing's wider. We just need some uh, row crop tires uh, when we go spraying our own, if we have to spray. Oop, I almost messed up. Whoa, raise the boom up a little bit. There we go. This thing's light on the front end and it's making it hard to steer. But folks, um, while we're doing this and just kind of goofing off a little bit, don't forget to go down below, check out the links of the other YouTubers and my, do I call it merchandise? Because it's not really my thing. Let's just call it my links. I uh, got the can cursor, got the uh, light for the camera or for any use, actually. It, if you got a quarter inch uh, boat, it, it screws on just like a nut, you know. It, quarter inch boat mount it to some kind of bracket or something and uh, I, I need to get that video out on it I, that way y'all probably get more ideas what you can do with it and stuff but I, I got it up in my head what to do but just uh, making it do uh, is a challenge uh, you know it's like I want to do it this way I want to do it that way but life throws at you curveballs and you'll be middle making a video and all of a sudden de -de 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 -de. you have a structure fire at such and such address please advise uh, 
someone trapped or neighbor's house is close to being on fire too or you know you get those pages like that when you start to do stuff and you can go a whole month or you can go one day and it, it don't matter it's always something that's going to pop up which I ain't making an excuse it's just letting y'all know what's going on you know between two teenage kids uh, 16 and 15 fixing to be in the next year older not too long but you know in life it, itself you're uh, taking care of your parents and trying to do the paperwork for them from the hospitals and the insurance companies and and scammers trying to scam you and yes we are a member of United Health and we would like to offer you some detailed insurance free of charge all you have to do is fill out these papers and uh, you know they want your address your phone number your social security number your age birth date and I just I don't give that stuff out over the phone you don't have to send me a letter that's still it that's when you have to watch and uh, cause scammers they try to get you any which way possible All right, I'm gonna go over to this other side. That's enough of my life, right? How about y'all? Y'all dealing with scammers and, and stuff like that? Now, don't get me wrong with my parents. I, I love taking care of my parents, mom and dad. It's no biggie there. It's just the paperwork that comes. You gotta be really careful if it's true paperwork for their hospitals and stuff, insurance. Or if it's a scammer, you know, it's just that's what gets aggravating. There's the scammers out there that tries to really sink their hands in on older people that you know, like my mom, she's only got a second grade education, but you know, she learned everything growing up the hard way, and and uh, she didn't know about the IRS scammers and stuff, and she almost. I came in one day and she almost, you know, gave them all her information. She's like, well, it's from the IRS. I'm like, IRS don't call you. Hang up. She's like, huh? So she finally hung up. Yeah, it's just stuff like that, folks. And, and my buddy, he's going through some hard times, too. Uh, but I'm not going to get in those details because that's not my place. All right, I'm going to stop right here for a second. Uh, Mr. Yankee's doing good over there. Folks, what do we plant? I don't know what we need to plant. Um, let's go in here and see what's, what's uh, cooking. Um... You know, if we have, I'm, I'm thinking about soybeans because they're about the highest. You don't get very much of them. Now, wheat and straw, we can also do oats. Oats is higher. I think we get, uh, I know we get straw off of these. And I don't know about canola. I don't know if canola gives straw or not. And you also get soybean and corn straw, but corn ain't very high. Hmm, cotton's a good price. Um, see, these are, can't really make out the symbols, but it looks like a soybean. I have no, I think it's compost. That's washed potatoes, that's, uh, sorted potatoes, I believe. And of course, we got regular potatoes over here. Um, sugar cane, yeah, regular potatoes, yeah, it's just, I don't know. Y'all, let me know down below. Do we do oats? Wheat, barley, or soybeans. Um, yeah, we're going to do planting in the next episode because we're kind of reaching that 20 minute mark. Oh. He's 90% full. We're going to have to go empty the combine. Oh, whoa, oh. Oh, oh, oh. That's not going to be good. 
got to watch where you're going, people. Oh, we hung up. All right, I'm going to stop right there. We'll take care of that in the next episode. Oh, me oh my. Well, it didn't hurt nothing as of yet. So maybe I can cut over there and cut here and, and stuff like that. Let's check out our combine again. And see, we get a... Uh, we get the price off of this field and we get soybeans what the owner's contract consists of what is left will go to us and this thing this is pretty, about the size of one of our fields because this is a little longer and narrow than ours and he's not getting very much soybeans off here he's 94 I don't think he can hope very much more so we're going to go ahead and empty him out. And folks, I will be back in a second when he's done with this. And I'll show you the outcome. Be right back. All right, this buggy does not like this tractor. It's not pulling straight. And very, very tail spinny. Oh, look at Oh. I guess because I'm going too fast, maybe? Alright. Load the pickup. We turn it on. Don't tell me I don't have access. I do. I do, buddy. Might not be what you think. Oh, it works good going. Oh, yeah. We got a good size pickup now on this newer loader wagon, and it helps a lot. Um, but, yeah, I said I was going to do the tractor in the next in the next episode, folks, but yeah, um, let's go ahead and shut this off, and shut the tractor down, our Maxim 285 is awesome, yeah, I bet you didn't put the auger out before you left, oh, a little rough, oof, oof, a little rough going across those, but anyway, folks, he is done with this one. And it's going to go to, uh, da, 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 I don't forgot, Village Grain Elevator, I think. Do I need to get closer? Probably so. Or do I? I don't know. Perfect. Perfect. Couldn't do that before if I wanted to. Anyway, field 15 or is it field 20? Field 20. Oh yeah, field uh, 8 is finalized, so let's collect that. And uh, we just got field 36 to go. Um, bunch of uh, harvesting and cultivating ones. Ooh, 84%. Ooh. Oh, wait, I forgot. Where's that going? Village Grain Elevator. Okay. We're going to fold this in. I want to talk to the other farmer, or the farmer that owns that combine, and see if uh, we can do that contract. I'll probably do that in off screen. Let me take us to Village Grain Elevator and see how much we get, and uh, we'll end the episode there. So I'll be right back in a sec. All right, we made it here, and we got. What is that? 8,115 liters of soybeans. Let's hope that finalizes that contract. I'm going to get the dollar sign up here where y'all can see it in the top right. I hope. Oh, there we go. Contract field 20 is finished. And it gave us 2,100 for the, the soybeans off of that. So not bad. Not bad at all. Let's see, before I get any further, let's go ahead and go in here, even though it's auto saving. Let's see, do I want to, I don't want to finalize that yet, folks, because that's got a uh, straw on it. I'm looking for field 15 now. Let's see, um, bailing 16. Oh man, did somebody done take field 15? 27. 
I sure don't see field 27 anywhere. I mean, uh, 15, field 15. Well, okay. Well, if it's going to be that way, we'll go ahead and finalize this contract. And uh, I'm thinking about starting this in here. And it's uh, going to be potatoes. It's going to take a while, but it's 18000 folks. Just two pieces of equipment. Well, three. Potato thing and a tractor. And we can be doing our stuff. So let's uh, borrow items on that. So let's fill 33 doing potatoes. And this 20 here, we're just going to collect it. So we $1,000. I got uh, any more fertilizing? I don't see no more fertilizing. All right, folks, we're going <clears throat> we're going to leave it at that. And here's the equipment for the potatoes. Uh, I guess next episode we'll be doing potatoes. And uh, y'all let me know. Um, by the time y'all see this, y'all it'll probably be too late. So. Just go ahead and put your comments down below anyway. And the uh, comments of what y'all think I should plant. And we'll see if it'll rack up on what on what I do. Now, what field is this? Oh, I see 33, but it's not flashing. Okay. Well, I'm going to put that on follow me. Folks, I appreciate y'all uh, taking your time watching my video and stuff. I hope y'all enjoy it, and um, we'll be making plenty more. So uh, if you're interested, hit that red button there, subscribe button. And um, yeah, Monday, Tuesday, uh, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And uh, oh, look at the skinny wheels on top, or up front. But yeah. Um, 15 mile an hour, this is going to take a while. Oh my. But anyway, uh, share me with your friends, folks, trying to get to a thousand family members, and uh, yeah, uh, trying to get on up there. But I do thank each and every one of y'all. I love each and every one of y'all very, very much, folks. Don't you worry on me. I don't know. I got about 30. Uh, but yeah, I, I do love y'all folks. It, yeah, I love the, all the comments and stuff y'all do. I'm not just saying that. I actually mean that. They are totally awesome and rock in my book. But now it's time for me to go. I gotta go do some potatoes. Yeah. Alright folks, y'all have a good one. A great one. A blessed one. And I will see y'all later. Bye.